What's up guys, this is Nansu here, and I want to start off that most of what I'm about to say might shock you if you didn't hear about what did these people do, did, or you might comment saying, but Nansu, why are you telling you video that if you, if that's what you're going to talk about those people, I mean, if you're going to just talk about those people. Well, I didn't ask you, little Timmy, so sit down, but thanks for asking. We have gotten to a point where we can barely trust anyone on the internet or believe what they say. As of 2020 and 2021, we have been getting so many people exposed and canceled on the internet. Take me and for example. Before 2020, we thought he was an innocent and makes good content. Nope. Turns out he's a creep in pedo. File. Not only that, he made a very crappy apology and he got in even more hate from it. Mando, a legend who made great music during FNAF times. Pedo too and he didn't even try to defend himself on the internet. Great show, Mando. You are a sick freak. Smash community. Some of them are creeps. And they ruined Smash community because of it. Knowing that one of them um, is like a jerk and something. I don't know. You can go search him up. Not only that, Dr. Apis. Whatever his name is, or how you spell it. A man who was supposed to end Yandere Dev's entire career by making a better game groomed a 10 year old. A fucking 10 year old. I have no words. It's firing it out. Like, Bro, you're supposed to end the evil in your game series. What you did, you joined it. Hope you're happy. You hope you, you went through the odd time making a game and you got caught. Uh, you canceled the game too. Yeah, for the people who's not catching what I'm saying, these people who show as good people with good intentions are actually monsters we did effed up stuff at the at this point we the people on the internet are worried about if their favorite youtuber or streamer is a freak a jerk a pedophile or some other stuff recently Carson was getting canceled for doing stuff with his 16 year old on Discord, or I think it was text messages, I don't know. And Dream Stands, and who are messed up in the head and made porn of a 17 year old. I'm literally like, what is wrong with you? You deserve to be executed on the street. We have gone into a bad spot on the internet right now, but that's not what scares YouTubers the most. It's cancer culture. That's what scares them the most. 